teaching me about how I should not be mean to my brother, and when he's mean to me, just let him get all his anger out. Then I then we got into the subject of Jesus and God, and I was wondering how God knew our fate for how either we went to hell or heaven. Then he told me about rejoice, or yeah, about salvation. Oh yeah, salvation, and then. She pulled it up and quote unquote said how to be saved. Well, so what what happened next? Then she asked if I what happened inside of me and then I said I felt warm in my belly, which I did, and now your child off. So that is so incredible, so awesome. The absolute biggest thing that you could ever imagine on this earth. I cannot even explain how excited I am for you. Oh, so now not only are you my nephew, you're also my brother in Christ. We are all brothers and sisters in Christ. One of my favorite verses, I think this is your mama's favorite, favorite verse, but it's it's in Philippians in the Bible, and it's Philippians 4.13, and it says, I, I shall do all things for Christ. Who strengthens me, yes. That's, <laughs> and, one, that's one of our school Bible verses. So, um, so now, it's so cool because no matter how bad you are, no matter... If you've done something terribly wrong, you just pray and you tell Jesus about it and he immediately just washes it clean. And the biggest thing is he he starts changing things inside of you to make it easy for you to let go of all the negative stuff, all the stress, all the worry, all the bad things that we do as humans because we live in this world and he helps us every day every single day he makes you stronger and stronger and makes you more like him and that is the coolest thing about this whole entire life this is so awesome luke oh i wish i could hug you right now i'm sending you a big huge hug mm. i love you so much i love you too well, I want to hear more about it as because this is like right when you when you first go through this, it's really cool because God makes these great, big, beautiful changes in your life. And you get to see everything with this whole new set of eyes and you see everything like a little bit brighter and you can see God in his creation. You just look into creation and you can see him in all these places and you just start seeing like how great God is everywhere you look even in tough stuff and so I can't wait to hear what you start seeing and how new it is for you that's so so awesome so I want to hear more as as the days go okay okay all right bud well that is the that is the greatest thing to be grateful for. Um, <laughs> so there's a, a song that I like. It's a hymn. And it's, um, I don't know if you've ever heard it, but it's um, some glad morning when this life is o'er, I'll fly away, hallelujah, to a home on God's celestial shore. I'll fly away, fly away, I'll fly away. So, 
This is the day that the Lord has made, that the Lord has made. Oh, I got one for you, Luke. I got one for you for today. And it's kind of a spelling assignment. I am a C. I am a C-H. I am a C-H-R-A-S-T-I-E-N. And I have C-H-R-I-S-T in my H-E-A-R-T. And I will L-I-V-E-E-T-E-R-N-A-L-L-Y. I am a C. I am a C-H. Can you send me the email Yes, I will definitely do that. Look at that sunset. That sunset is so beautiful, Melody. Oh! Look at that sunset. See what I mean? See how awesome? Oh, this is so great. Oh, all right. I'm going to hang up right now because I want you guys to sit, if it's safe, to take a picture of that sunset so I can see it. Okay. I love you so much. I'm so excited. Yes, I will send you the email of that song. Oh, but on the other song... Ask your daddy to pull it up for you because he and I listened to that one together and it's this guy who does it kind of like bluegrass. And every time I hear it, I can't help but getting up and like I'm slapping my leg and I'm like dancing around is great. 